Parents, do you live in Muskogee County and have a child that will be four years old on or before September 1st? If so, registration for Muskogee County School District's pre-K program is now open. A quality preschool experience prepares a child to succeed in kindergarten and beyond. Get more information by scanning this QR code or contact the pre-K department listed here. Hi friends, it's Miss Lani from the Columbus Public Library and today we are going to have a very quacky story time. I have some good silly books to share with you all. Are y'all ready? Let's get started. The first book that we're going to read today is called Quack by Arthur Yorinks. Now this book is written in a very special language. The language of quack, 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 quack. Quack the moon. Can y'all see what's happening here? It looks like Quack is looking at the moon. So Quack quacked. And Quack 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 quack. All right. So he's talking in duck language, but we're going to interpret it in English. And it looks like he was looking at the moon and he decided that he wanted to go to the moon. So of course, he had to build a rocket ship. Once his rocket ship is done, it's time to blast off. Quack, 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 quack. Or as we would say, blast off. Quack, 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 quack. So there he is. He's flying to the moon. He's landed on the moon. But the raccoons quack, quack, quack. And even little dog quack, quack, quack. What do you think that means in English? It looks like the raccoons and the little dog, they're sad. So quack, quack means that they missed quack. Even Mrs. Cow, quack, quack, quack. And the crocodiles, they quack, 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 too. But meanwhile, on the moon, quack, quacked, and quacked, and quacked. So that means he was sad, and he was crying because he was missing his friends, too. So quack. Looks like it's time for him to go back home. And quacked and quacked and quacked and quacked and quacked and quacked and quacked. So there he is floating down back to earth. Quack! Everyone's so excited to see him. Quack, quack, quack. Everybody's saying, welcome back, quack. We missed you so much. Quack back home. Everybody's so excited. Quack's excited. The crocodile's excited. Mrs. Cow is excited. Everyone is so excited that Quack is back home. Quack, quack. The end. I like this book because it is in Quack. It's in a duck language but you can easily tell everything that's going on in the book just by looking at the pictures. So we don't even have to read this book in English to know what is going on. Quack looked at the moon. He decided he wanted to go to the moon, so he built a rocket ship. He flew to the moon and he realized that he missed all of his friends back at home. There's no place like home. Or as Quack would say, Quack, Quack. All right, boys and girls, now that we know how ducks communicate and what they sound like, are we able to identify what a duck looks like? Okay, I'm gonna give you a test. This is a duck, right? 
no 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 wait i'm sorry this is a rabbit this is a rabbit and this is a duck right duck rabbit rabbit and a duck a duck goes quack quack and a rabbit goes hop hop rabbit and duck all right so what is this i really don't know so i really need your help what is this is this a duck or is this a rabbit i don't know but luckily i have a book that we can read that will help us figure out if this is a duck or a rabbit because i just need to know all right boys and girls let's read duck rabbit by amy cross rosenthal and we will finally figure out is this a duck or is it a rabbit hey look a duck wait don't be silly that's a rabbit are you kidding me it's totally a duck no it's for sure a rabbit No, it's a duck. Look, see, this is the duck's bill, also known as his mouth. Oh, wait, wait a minute. I'm sorry, I was looking at that wrong. This is the rabbit's ears. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's definitely a rabbit. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. It's a duck because look, here's the bill and it's getting ready to eat some bread. Yeah, so it's a duck. Yeah, it's definitely a duck. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Um, this is, it's a rabbit because it's getting ready to eat a carrot. I was, I'm sorry, I was wrong. It's definitely, definitely, definitely a rabbit. Wait, listen, did you hear that? I heard duck sound. Quack, quack, quack. Okay, yeah, that's what a duck sounds like. So it's a duck. Wait, I think I, I think I hear... I think I hear a rabbit sniffing. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know what it is. I, is it a duck or is it a rabbit? All right, let's look at this picture. It could be a duck that's wading through the swamp. Or is it a rabbit that's hopping through the grass? I still don't know. What do you guys think out there? Is it a duck or is it a rabbit? Look, it's flying. So it's clearly a duck. Wait, it's not flying. It's hopping and ducks don't hop. Rabbits hop. So it's a rabbit. Yeah. No, look, it is a duck because it is so hot that it's getting a drink of water. Or is it a rabbit and it's so hot that he's cooling off his ears? I don't know, boys and girls, what do you think? I'm, I'm getting more and more confused. All right, can you guys put on some binoculars? We're gonna take a very close look. All right, are you looking? Huh. Is it a duck or is it a rabbit? I don't know. Let's try calling it and see what happens. Here, ducky, 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 ducky. Here, ducky, ducky, ducky. Okay, so it didn't answer to that. Let's try this. Here, cute little rabbit. Here, cute little rabbit. Oh, great. We scared him away. Now, we'll never know if it was a duck or a rabbit. What do y'all think out there? You know what? Maybe, maybe it was a rabbit. I think it was a rabbit. Yeah, it was definitely a rabbit because that was the ears. Yeah, it was definitely a rabbit. Oh, wait, was it a duck? I don't know. It could have been a duck or it could have been a rabbit. I just don't know. <laughs> Well, maybe it's just whatever you decided. Was it a duck or was it a rabbit? Anyway, what do you wanna do now? 
I don't know. What do you want to do now? Hey, look, an ant eater. No, 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 no. That's not an ant eater. That's a brachiosaurus. Oh, no. Not again. The end. All right, boys and girls. Was it a duck or was it a rabbit? We'll never know. And that's okay. It can be whatever you thought it was. So if you thought it was a duck, then quack, quack, quack. And if you thought it was a rabbit, then you're hoppity right. I hope you enjoyed our story time today. That's all that I have for us. And I cannot wait until next time. I'll find some more silly books to share with you. The end. Bye. 90% of brain growth happens before kindergarten. 90%. So talk, sing, read, write, and play with your child every day. Those five simple steps build the foundation for a lifetime of learning. Thank you.